I'm going to show you how to draw a net for a tetrahedron using a compass. So first of all I take my piece of paper and I put my point of my compass in the middle of the paper. It doesn't have to be exactly the middle. Then I'm going to make the width of the radius as big as I can. I'm going to turn around, oh that's too big. And Let's try again. That's going to be a little bit too big. Okay, so there's my circle. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to start with my point anywhere on the circle and I'm going to mark off that radius. I've got to keep the radius unchanged and keep moving around your circle until you've got six of these points. And make sure you hit those points as accurately as you can. Hopefully this will take me back where, to I, where I started. Good. Now what I need to do, I'm going to create an equilateral triangle by starting at one point and connecting up the point which is next but one. And again, next but one point. Not the next one, the next but one. Try and use a sharp pencil for this. And get it as, as exact as you can. Now what I need to do is I need to find the halfway point of this line. And the way I'm going to do that is by connecting my connecting one vertex with the point on the outside of the circle that is opposite it. And I'm just going to make a small mark to show that this is halfway. So I'm going to turn this round and again I'm going to connect from this point to this point here, which was the mark on the original circle. And again, I just need a tiny little mark. And finally, this one here. Then all I need to do is connect up these three centre points. So there's my net. All I need to do now, if I wanted to make this into a 3D shape, is put some flaps on. You can just draw those on. And the way I would do this is do one, skip one. Do one, skip one. Do one, skip one. And that's how to make a net for a tetrahedron.